Hey, what's up guys? This is Ray Brizzy of Lucky Cat Beats. And in today's video, I'm actually going to be showing you how to make a chill lo-fi beat using Scalar. Alright, so, um, let's open up Scalar. And, um, so I was going around, messing around, looking at stuff. And I ended up choosing the gospel, uh, genre. And then on the gospel genre, I went on the three. Uh, and then I picked these chords out of there. Um, I'm gonna just, just play them here and uh, show you guys what I did. So it should be right here. So. And that's practically what I did. Um, the only different thing that I did here is I just made it uh, humanized. Cause I, I like uh, Joy Badass a lot. Um, and a lot of his songs he uses a lot of roads and so I ended up choosing roads. Yep. Yeah, so I use uh, um, the 7-3 uh, roads on it and then I adjusted a little bit on it. Uh, I did a little bit of editing. Um, a little bit of waves on it and a little bit of the phaser but that's about it um, so that's what I so that's what I did for the loop um, for the next thing that I added I went go I, I went to go look for certain sounds and so you know I went to splice and I found me some sounds Alright, so um, this is one of the first ones that I found and I use this for the uh, for the verse. You'll end up hearing it, but I want to show you what it sounds uh, normally. Ba, 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 da, do, 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 do. So that's the first one I chose. And then there was another one. Um, it's the way, ma. So you can it's hear... The way, ma. <laughs> it's the way, ma. It's the way, ma. Alright, so I chose both of those and then I'm gonna show you what it sounds like together. Um, so let me let the song play. And I'm gonna turn it up so you guys can hear it. Alright, so that's pretty much the intro of it. And then um, what I practically did to change it, I just, on reason, you can transpose it, but you could do the same with any other dog. Um, so that's that. And then I also, uh, so this is what the, the other voice sounds like now, after I edit, edited. And so for that, I practically just added a uh, reverb on it, and then I use this one called Lustrous Plate. Um, let me see which one I use in particular. I use large dark vocal, and then I kind of EQ'd some of it how I wanted. Um, and then I added an H delay. Uh, I just wanted to have like a little like of like lingering on it, so that's what the H delay is for. And yeah, so that's all I really did for it. And then let me play the rest of it. All right, so I had picked this uh, loop from Splice just to kick in the snare. I, I thought this was a pretty cool uh, kick. Pretty simple, pretty cool, I like it. Um, so that's that. And then I added a bass line. So let, let me play the bass line for you. And originally, I didn't know that Native Instruments had a bass that sounded at least kind of somewhat uh, realistic. And so I just practically went to a browser, uh, you look for it, you put a uh, bass, and then you put fingered bass or any of like that. And the one that I use is jazz. And you have to EQ it a little bit up here to get it to sound how I have it. And then I ended up using some stock plugins from, uh, wow, 
yeah, actually, I'm not sure if this is a stock plugin or not, but it's called uh, Bass Amp. So I ended up using this one. So uh, let me uh, just play it for you. And let me bypass it. So it just gives it a little bit like more like electric feel to it. So let me play you um, what I added for the chorus. Um, it's a pad and the pad is from Contact. And let's see if it's open. The pad is called Dark Tremors and I like again, you kind of decide what you kind of want it to sound like and uh, yeah, let me play it for you and see if it plays. It isn't playing it. I am about to kill someone. Alright, uh, hold on, let me try to figure out something. Yeah, so I just grabbed the same exact um, MIDI chords from uh, Scalar and then I just put them into this hybrid keys sound. Um, and then I made this little melody at the very beginning, at the very end of it. Let me see if I can move it so that you guys can hear it. And then I played this one as well. And so that's what I did for most of the song. The song wasn't really simple. I mean, the song wasn't really difficult. It was really simple. And the way that I end the song is it just kind of fades out. <laughs> And that's how I finished the song. So that's practically how to make a chill uh, boom bat beat. If you guys like this video, make sure that you uh, like the video and that you subscribe to the channel. Um, I actually made a podcast. So if you want to watch it, I'll leave the, the link down below in the description. Um, and if you want free beats, make sure that you sign up for the free beats. Uh, this is Ray Brizzy on Lucky Cat Beats. Peace.